Welcome to G-Man Gaming and Reviews. Alright, so we're going to continue on from... Uh, we're going to continue on to our next series. We're going to continue on with our Tales of the Two Wastelands, Fallout New Vegas, um... Um... Tales of Two Wasteland Fallout 3 Fallout slash Fallout New Vegas gameplay. Um, so we've checked Hamilton's hideaway. And we didn't find the family there. These cars can actually still blow up. I didn't know that they could actually still blow up. You'd think they would have blown up due to the not the Scorpions. Fruit. Ah, uh, rad roaches.
Oh, very nice. Free war money. Ooh, beer. Carton of cigarettes. That's a good load. stuff have we got? I have a feeling I'm going to end up having to... This was quite the good haul. Mentats. Ashtray. little safe from the vault. We've been looking for you. Someone's put quite a price on your head. Why? You... Medic should give me extra damage resistance. Yeah, I had all that stuff. Ooh, another assault rifle.
32 rifle. Oh, I didn't see the beer. Oh, that's right. So we're going to drink a, a beer. And now we can fast travel. and steal my secrets, are you? Good. I was afraid I was going to have to abandon my lab here. That would mean starting all over again. It's not easy trying to make Ultra Jet, you know. I suppose you could say that. Ultra Jet is almost double the potency of Jet. Perfect for ghouls. Jet barely affects us, you see. Only trouble is, it's almost impossible to gather the ingredients together. Say, you might be able to help me with that. It takes three things to make Ultra Jet. 
Two of the ingredients I got plenty of. The other one is a little harder to find. Sugar bombs. I distill it down to its base contents and add that to the formula, then presto, ultra jet. For every box of sugar bombs you bring me, I'll pay you 15 caps. So, you in? Nope. It's 15 each. You wanna do it or what? Good. Now get going. I have a ton of preparation to do. The hell you look at that smooth skin? Watch it, will ya? So, what did you bring me? Sure. I stay away from them and they don't bother me. It's a good relationship. They live somewhere east of here. If you're feeling foolish, I think there's an underground way through their place, deeper into the metro station here. He's my assistant and my backup, in case things get rough. I wouldn't mess with him if I were you. Yeah, as soon as... I do not know what's bloody down here. And those mild lurks are tough. I know you're there.
these guys are tough. Ah, uh, there's going to be mile lurks coming up from there. Mirelurk and it's dead. Holy crap. I was lucky that that Mirelurk was dead there. Right, we're gonna save because I have a feeling that we're gonna get killed. That's a hammer. It's a mile look. Something went off. I don't know what it was, but something went off. I gotta start keeping an eye out for these trip wires. Get something. Ooh, another combat shotgun. Might as well repair it. Very, very nice. this linked to must have been linked to something ah 
this thing. Slow down there. This area is off limits to everyone but the family. Where the hell do you think you're going? Oh, the new kid? Yeah, Vance said we should be expecting someone soon. You can head on in, but I would speak to Vance first if I was you. You can find him on the mezzanine overlooking the common area. We are a badass gang, and we don't take shit from nobody. We also don't like nosy assholes who creep around asking too many stupid questions. This lovely hole in the ground is Moresti, the headquarters of the family. Just remember... Okay. Let's go in the other direction. That was a baseball.
Is that what I think it is? That's a can. got my armor on. No, I've got no bloody wonder I should have had the armor on. No wonder I was getting it I was taking lots of damage from the the mile lurks. Ooh, they've got a lot of guns. I think I'm gonna kill them. They've got a lot of guns. They got a lot of hardware. What the? What's going on here? Never seen you around here before. Hey there, how's it going? Okay, I guess. The new guy's taking up most of my time, but I think he'll come around. He's been through some serious shit. Hey, with Vance teaching him personally, he's bound to figure it all out soon enough. I wouldn't worry about it. Welcome to our home. My people call me Vance. I lead this group of weary travelers and outcasts who need a home. And to what do I owe the pleasure of your visit? What you see before you is the last bastion of hope for the downtrodden and misunderstood. It is a sanctuary for the oppressed and a beacon of faith for the tyrannized. We are the remnants of society, cast aside like the clean-picked bones of a hunter's feast. I led my flock beneath the sun-baked sands of the wastelands to keep them safe and teach them my ways. Men of science would call us cannibals, eaters of human flesh. Society labels us as monsters, demons, and the unclean. Humans call for our extermination or reform. Reforming implies something is wrong with us and needs to be eliminated. I think of my teachings as more of an improvement, a way to transcend our cannibalistic nature. Your open-mindedness is very rare for a human. I find that fascinating. Allow me to bolster your insight with a lesson in objectivity. I say we are no longer cannibal, only consuming the blood of our prey. What would that make us in your eyes? Then 
That is a mystery you will have to solve on your own. In ceremony, each member of the family must speak one of the laws. It is theirs to remember and to enforce. Perhaps from these laws you can discover what they are. Return to me when you are ready. See you later. I don't think we've been properly introduced. I'm Holly, Vance's wife. I'm afraid Vance has him in isolation, and there's no way I'm going to override Vance's orders. He's a good kid. I think Vance will set him along the correct path soon. Like he did for all of us. You don't think he's already messed up? Come on, don't kid yourself. We pulled him out of that shithole town just in time. Like I said, he's in isolation. It's his time to meditate and reflect. Each of us is required to speak one of the laws when we hold our ceremonies. I say the first law. Feast not on the flesh, consume only the blood. This is our strength. This is Moresti, the home of the family. It's the only safe place for these poor people. It was good. What you need? My husband started this group not long ago. They come from all over the wasteland now. To f it w you look quite troubled, my darling. What's on your mind? I don't know what I should do. I mean, I'll find this va I'll find this kid Ian West and see what he has to say. was a bit chewy. Know what I mean? When Vance stands on that balcony and starts mouthing off like some kind of preacher, it makes me want to puke. But if I want to keep this place stocked, I gotta have his permission. So I learned his fifth law. Kill not our kindred. Slay only the enemy. This is our justice. Pretty silly if you ask me. Do I look like a fucking baby? Oh, tough shit. This is the real world. You want to know something? Find it out your damn self. Ian, Ian. This place is my place of business. What's he got? Got twenty three scrap metal. Thanks. We're the last. Hmm. I don't think I've met you yet. The name 
Oh, wait. Vance told me I was supposed to say something. Oh, right. The third law is feed not for pleasure, partake only to nourish. This is our dignity. Whew, almost forgot it again. I don't have... Justin's been trying to talk to Ian, make him feel better. Maybe you should speak to him. Right now I call this place home. Well, anyone that Vance takes in because of their special pro... Well, well, I'm surprised you don't know me. I'm Brianna. I take care of the men around here. Well, unmarried ones, anyway. Vance has him in meditation right now. No one's supposed to be in there. Poor kid. He looks like he could use another friend. Well, that is sweet, but Vance would kick my rather gorgeous ass right out of here if I told you how to find Ian. Sorry. When we all gather in the common area, Vance gives his speeches, and then we each have, like, a law to say. Mine is, bear not the child, welcome only the exile. This is our fate. Kinda cool, huh? It's the last place I ever expected to end up. I mean, look at this place. It's so dark and dingy. What this place needs is a lady's touch. But don't tell Vance I said that. How about just the coolest gang this side of the U.S.? As long as we listen to Vance's rules and listen to his stuff, he lets us do pretty much whatever we want. Nope. Well, hey there, cutie. How's it hanging? I thought I knew everyone in the family, but I don't recognize you. You must be one of Vance's new initiates. My name's Justin. I'm pretty new here myself. Ian, what do you want from him? It's outsider's perspective. Surprised? Well, Ian was there when it happened and did nothing to stop it. If you ask yourself why, the answer is obvious. He belongs with us here. He's one of us. Don't deny him his rightful home. No, just that Vance said he isn't to be disturbed while he's in meditation. How do you know that? If you've spoken to him like I have, Ian confides in me. Well, Vance makes each of us remember a rule. And when we all gather in the common area, we have to say it out loud. Kind of weird. So, my law is the fourth one. Seek not the sun's light. Embrace only the shadows. This is our refuge. It's a great way to get back at those assholes out there who think we're losers. If it wasn't for Vance, I'd still be getting the crap beat out of me by those guards in Rivet City. Well, Vance told me that this place was called Moresti. It was named after some town way across the ocean in a place called Romania. Great, actually. I finished my first round of studies in Vance. I don't know what to do. I can't believe he just sat there while his family got killed. How much space do I have? 147. I'm going to buy all that scrap metal. Because why not? Scrap metal is precious. You going to gawk all day or you... Buy that. And the scrap metal. Give me a shout if you need anything else. All right.
I am really, really sorry to do this, but... Where is this meditation chamber? If I go to this quest, locate Ian West. Hello again. I'm really, really sorry, but I'm going to have to kill you. I really, really, really didn't want to do this. The isolation has to be... Yeah, it has to be in this direction. Assault rifle, scrap metal. Alright, so uh, we're going to call it a day. This was G-Man Gaming in Reviews. Please like and subscribe. Stay tuned to see what, to stay tuned to see what happens next. Alright, bye.